Good morning, Sagittarius. This reading is for you. This is your next 48 hours. If you have Sagittarius anywhere in your chart, this reading is the next 48 hours for you. Sun, Moon, and Rising. Sagittarius, I'm so very sorry that this reading is late. I was feeling under the weather and I feel my voice kind of going, you know. So I really needed to rest it. So again, I'm very sorry for it being late. Let's see what we have for Sagittarius. We have the King of Pentacles. Wow, we have the Knight of Pentacles. Let's see what else we have for Sag. The next 48 hours, please. The Three of Pentacles. Lots of Pentacles in this reading. This may have to do with your money and finances. Definitely. The Two of Cups. <clears throat> we have the Queen of Wands. Wow, Sagittarius. The Six of Swords. The Ace of Pentacles. We have the Seven of Wands. And we have the Five of Wands. Okay. At the bottom, we have the Justice card. So, Sagittarius, the next 48 hours. I feel like some kind of truth is going to come out. If you're in some kind of contract or judgment, some kind of legal matter, I feel like that's going within your way. You're finding out about that. Something is going in your favor. Some kind of karma is being rewarded to you within the next 48 hours. I feel like something that you've been waiting for, something maybe that has been delayed, is coming forward for you in the next 48 hours. Okay, your overall energy is the King of Pentacles. You're very wise. You're spending your money very wisely. You're watching your pennies. I feel like this is also you being very practical, being very solid. Your wealth is increasing for you. This is some kind of increase coming forward for you in the next 48 hours. We have a lot of pinnacles here. So I feel like maybe something in your job, something in your finances, uh, excuse me, is coming forward for you. Because we have the Knight of Pentacles here. This is giving you some kind of information. You're taking some kind of action. Um, I believe this is finances, maybe that some kind of information on these finances have been delayed. And you've been waiting for word on this information. It could be a tax refund. It could be some kind of check. Some kind of loan that you've applied for. But this information is coming into you. And it's coming into you very, very quickly now. Um, the Pinnacles was basically at a standstill. You know, it was slow moving. The process felt like it took forever, you know. The Pentacles is stuck. Action. Not really taking action, but standing still. Standing. Having patience, you know. But I feel like with the Six of Swords at the bottom, I feel like it's moving forward now. It's moving in your direction. Whatever you've been waiting for is coming very shortly. We also have the Three of Pentacles. So I feel like this is you teaming up with someone. You collaborating with someone. This could also be support coming in for you. I feel like you're supported in this situation. You are receiving the help that you need in the situation. So, I believe that whatever this is that you're waiting on, it's coming, and it's coming very strongly. Sagittarius, you also have love.
kindness, friendship. This is also coming in within the next 48 hours. You may receive some kind of invitation from this Queen of Wands. It may be a Leo, a Leo Ar Aries or Sagittarius. But this could also be your energy. Um, I feel like you're very assertive. You're moving forward in a very strong position. You're having courage. You're being totally aware of your situation. Um, this is also you having full confidence that things will work in your favor because you, you see and you understand that it's moving close to you. It's moving towards you. This gift, this money that you've been waiting on is moving in your direction and it's going to bring you more calmness. It's going to bring you, it's going to move you into a better, stronger position. We have the Ace of Pentacles. So this is a brand new beginning. This may be you leaving one position and moving to another position. This could also be you starting your own business, starting your own venture, moving into this new income, new job. This is a new beginning of some sort. Sagittarius and I feel like it's going to bring you more wealth more stability standing on solid ground this new beginning is going to have a lot of challenges I feel like with this new beginning that's coming forward for you it's taking you into a new direction but I feel like you're standing on your beliefs but you're protecting this. You may be in a lot of competition, whatever it is that you're building. You may have to compete with other people, uh, uh, other teams, other people. Like I said, if this is a job, I feel like it's very competitive. This is something that you really have to work at. But I feel like you're fighting strong. You're fighting strong. You have victory. I feel like you're standing on your toes and you are totally, you know, moving past these challenges, these obstacles. You're fighting for what it is you believe in. And that's very beautiful energy, Sagittarius. Very beautiful energy. Whatever this Ace of Pentacles is, I feel like you definitely have triumph. This is the will moving in your favor. The wheels of change, the wheels of karma, <clears throat> are changing your luck. Changing, this is a turning point. Wow. <laughs> Beautiful Sagittarius, I'm loving this. Wow. Um, we have the judgment card. So this change is going to bring you a renewal, a new hope. This is you leaving your comfort zone and trying this new destination. The, the people on the judgment card are where they have always been, but they need to, you know, take notice on this judgment and they need to um, move to a, a, um, a higher place. This is like a rebirth, a renewal. Okay, we also have the justice card. Wow, the second time. Sagittarius. Karma. Karma is coming around for you. This is you putting in the work and getting your rewards for your effort. This is cause and effect. You know, a win-win situation coming your way. Definitely. Oh my gosh. Sagittarius. Six of Wands. You have success. People are recognizing you. You're being lifted up for your progress. Um, this is also you being recognized. So if you have social media or something like that, I feel like people are looking at you. They're watching what you're doing. I feel like you have total victory in this situation. We also have the King of Wands. So the King of Wands, he's very courageous. He's fearless. He's an entrepreneur at heart. So whatever venture that he goes out to, he is successful. He is abundant. He's very close to the emperor. He's the closest, in fact, to the emperor in the tarot because he's so assertive and powerful. 
Um, and I feel like you're finding your power, Sagittarius. You're finding your power. We have the Queen of Cups. Wow. I feel like you're being fully supported. The Queen of Cups, she's also very intuitive. And she, she has the ability to heal. She's also very nurturing, very caring, very loving. And I feel like there's someone around you showing you that support. And I feel like you you have the need maybe to box yourself in to hold yourself back from the situation so the eight of swords energy this is something that you need to free yourself of this may be you overthinking a situation but within the next 48 hours something's going to come through that you need to really release yourself from stop binding yourself in a situation that's very important for you because it's going to bring you stability it's going to bring you longevity. So I feel like you're holding your ba yourself back from a decision. But you need to release that energy. So that you can uh, have this longevity. This long term security that's coming forward for you. This is also you protecting something. Holding it tight. I feel like this is something, some kind of secret that you're holding as well. But Sagittarius, you have strength. You have love. You have guidance. I feel like this is spirit guiding you along your path. Making sure that you're confident. And making sure that you're showing yourself this love and stability that you truly desire. I feel like your dreams, your wishes are being granted. And I feel like spirit is letting you know just how important just how special you are Sagittarius this is a lot of happiness a lot of strength a lot of contentment because wow you are the Empress you're very strong you're very capable now look what I said I said that the the King of Wands was so much like the Emperor well you're like the Empress you're like the Empress. You're very attractive. The Empress, she's able to manifest anything her heart desires. And I feel like you're in that ability at the moment. You're in that ability. Let's get some Moonology cards to see what else is going on with Sagittarius. Let's get some Moonology cards for Sagittarius. We have a new start is coming. Yes, there's definitely a beginning that is coming. You're going to have a new start in something within the next 48 hours. Meditate and contemplate. Spirit wants to feel close to you. They want to guide you through this, this energy with this strength card. I feel like spirit is on your side. So meditate so that you can hear what spirit has to say. We have balance, spirituality, practicality. Yes, definitely what I just said. You know, spirit wants to communicate with you. They want to know that you are supported. Be bold and make the first move. Definitely be assertive. That's that wands energy that I keep getting in this reading. And this is justice. Yes. And will of fortune. Luck is on your side, Sagittarius. And look at that. New moon in Sagittarius. This is your card. Luck is on your side. You have the angels watching over you. You have guidance. You're getting your just rewards. You're being recognized. Beautiful energy. We have acceptance. I am learning that ex to accept the things that I cannot change. Definitely ex acceptance. What else do we have? And we have health. So Sagittarius, there may be a need to really focus on your, your own healing. To focus on yourself. To make sure that you feel rejuvenated. To make sure that you feel balanced. 
to take a look at your health to make sure that you are in tip-top condition you know Sagittarius this is just saying I will honor the physical vessel that embraces my soul hmm And we have surrender. I can release my need to control. So I feel like those are going to be very important to you, Sagittarius. You're going to feel the need to surrender to the situation. I feel like it's very important. Let's get some more cards for Sagittarius. What does Sagittarius need to know in this situation? What does Sagittarius need to know, please? Confusion. So there may be some kind of thought processes that you're going to be going through. There, and I, I really feel that with the, the uh, Eight of Swords energy. I feel like there's some type of confusion that's holding you back. So I feel like you may need, need to um, listen closely and surrender so that you can hear the answers. There will be something that needs to be released in order for you to progress through this. I feel like you may need to release that confusion, that guilt, um, some kind of feeling so that you can process this and have this wonderful, beautiful renewal that's coming forward. So that's very beautiful energy here. And I feel like with this renewal, Sagittarius, you're gonna find balance. This is also justice energy. So this is this is beautiful energy coming forward for you. Okay, we're going to take a look at another deck. And we're going to get a few more answers for Sagittarius. What is going on for Sagittarius for the next 48 hours? Spirit. What's going on with Sagittarius? The King of Pentacles. We got the King of Pentacles again. Wow. Oh my goodness. This is very... <laughs> You're going to be very, very prosperous. This is something strong coming through for you. Just one moment, sir. Okay, sorry about that, Sagittarius. Back to what we were saying. Oh my goodness. So your clarifying message is also the King of Pentacles. So this is definitely bringing you more stability. This is br definitely bringing in more wealth. And look at this. Oh, Sagittarius. Whatever this is, this is going to bring you so much happiness. So much contentment. Your abundance is coming through because you fought so hard. You went through those challenges. You went through those struggles. You're, you didn't give up. I feel like those challenges and those obstacles that you've been through is what brought you to this destination. Um, I feel like this is also putting you into a more childlike nature. It's making you feel more playful. You may do things that you haven't did since you've been, you know, younger. But I feel like this is one wanting to, you to make some moves that's taking you into the situation. We have the Hermit card. So, yeah, I feel like this is you, you know, making those thoughtful decisions, making those plans, finding a different perspective on a situation that's going to lead you into a more strong position. The Hermit, he's following his path, but he's being led by the star. He's put together all of his healing 
His star is his past failures, his past wounds. And he's bottled them up in his star. He's being led on his journey by his healing. So, and I feel like you're releasing the past. You're releasing some kind of past wounds, past failures. And now you're dwelling on what can be. And you're making plans. You're changing your perspective on the situation. You're coming into your wisdom, your knowledge. This is your truth coming out. And we have the emperor. Wow. Definitely. I knew the emperor was going to come out sooner or later. Because we have the empress. And I could just feel that energy. So you're taking, you're taking total control of your situation. This is you having great, great victory. You have all the power, all the stamina, all the ability. The, the emperor, he's also very strong, very intelligent. He's also very wise and capable in his investments in his life, in his ability to manifest. He knows exactly the power that it takes to succeed. And I feel like this is a very powerful reading for you, Sagittarius. This is putting you into a very strong position. And I feel like all of your efforts are totally being rewarded. Whatever it is that you are building, it is definitely definitely worth the effort because you put a lot of time you put a lot of space into this energy and now you're coming out with the emperor energy with the ten of cups energy wow beautiful energy you know if you're open to love there's also love coming in for you some kind of fire and passion is coming out for you Sagittarius so I'm really loving this energy look at this look at this beautiful we have the Emperor the ten of cups the two of cups the queen of wands the Empress there's so much beauty coming out for you this is going to be a very strong 48 hours and this is going to manifest itself when you I feel like saying when your patience is kind of wearing thin, that is when this is going to totally manifest. Because I feel like you're waiting on some kind of delayed action. You're waiting on some kind of progress. Whether this is a business that you've started or whether this is a promotion or a new career. But I, I feel like you're waiting on some kind of situation and you feel like it's never going to come through. Well, Sagittarius, as soon as you feel like it's never going to come through, that's when it pops up. That's when this Empress energy kicks in. That's when this Emperor energy kicks in. And you have your power. You are in control. You have manifested this situation into your life so strongly that it has become reality for you. It has been brought to life. It has been totally transformed, you know, and it's going to bring you a lot of happiness, a lot of stability. Okay, Sagittarius. Oh, my God. You know, when I first started doing this reading, I was feeling a little un under the weather. But, oh, my goodness, Sagittarius, you made me feel so much better. I am so happy that this situation is coming to light for you. Okay, this is your reading, Sag. So if you have um, any questions, any answers, you know, put your comments below. And Sagittarius, take a look at your sun, moon, and rising for more messages. Um, and until your next reading, many blessings to you. Love and light.